I wanted to do this on stream yesterday when Tay was on, but it kind of got sidetracked because he started talking about like, yo, he should retire and all this. But I just did want to like show y'all this, this fire song that Uno the Activist dropped. Now, something to note, and people were noticing, Omega Music, that might be his new label or one that he's starting. However, people think that maybe that's pretty similar to Opie Young. But again, I'm... This song is hard as fuck. It's like more Atlanta trap type, which is kind of like the new wave. I, f I feel like, and look, I'm not saying that he's, I'm not saying that he's biting Cardi because we all know what's going on with, uh, with, with Uno and Cardi back in the day where Uno actually created the baby voice. So technically speaking, I feel like Uno could do whatever. And since he was associated with Cardi, people are always going to be like, oh no, you, you're biting him. But realistically, like, Nah, Uno kind of started it in a way. So, so that, that conversation is deaded. But considering there was a rage wave or era because of Whole Lot of Red, or even before that, because of Sofago and Trippy Red, which dropped before Whole Lot of Red, or at least the Mr. Rage was uh, previewed before then. Uh, that, uh, that now, since Cardi started dropping more like Atlanta shit, more, more trap shit, that now it's more acceptable, I want to say, for more underground artists to hop back on that wave. So play the fucking music video. Uh, uh, yeah. 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 Yo, y'all saying this ass, bro? Man, this song is hard. I know me and Uno have had our little scuffles, but behind the scenes, we're cool. It's not even, it's not even a thing. Uh, but yo, this shit is hard. Like this might be one of the best drops in 2024 so far. This is why he'll stay on the ground. Y'all are just hating, bro. This shit is hard. You got a lion tight wrist. A snake ain't like how to hiss. I got my nuts, I been knew how to piss. Uh. I pop that rock at a wrist. Uh -huh. yeah. I beat the pop work on my wrist. Yeah. The bullet don't miss. Uh. Yeah. But they don't miss. Why is I do my little down when I hit? Okay. Rick on my kick and I flip. Okay. They know the game over the flip. Okay. Pull up with black and little hit. Okay. I got some rub on my neck. I just took me a little X. I played in her body. I pop in a little X. Next, she wanna have sex. This is not check is the chest. Say you with that chest, so you will be hit. I come what I double rest. If I get arrested, I won't not confess. I took the bit, had a dress. Now she get a check for looking impressive. Yeah. He sounded like Kendrick a little bit there with the voice. Like, yeah. Yeah. Don't miss. I do my little down when I hit. Okay. Rick on my kick and I flip. Okay. They know the game over the flip. Okay. Pull up with black and little hit. Okay. I got some rub on my neck. I just took me a little X. Yeah. 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 Alright, y'all are just hating. Y'all are just hating. This song is crazy. I feel like I feel like Uno just gets hate because of his association with Cardi and because of like any person that Cardi's associated with in the past and maybe they had like some falling out which they did um 
way back they might talk occasionally now because they're like still i don't know if i i can't remember if uno said they were literally blood cousins or if that was just like a he's my cousin because he's like my, he's you know we're really close he said it on no jumper way back just because of that ordeal everyone will, no one will give him his flowers he is hard he is one of the reasons that Cardi is up at this point. Now I'm not saying Cardi wouldn't have done it himself because he's got the he's got the aura. As gay as that sounds, but it's true. Like Cardi just makes the right moves. Whereas Uno, I feel like he stayed independent, but he deserves his flowers. Like he should be like a he should be like a somewhat of a lucky. Because to be honest. He was one of the first artists that I, I discovered Uno before Cardi in the SoundCloud era of like 2015 when I first started to get into this scene because I started this back like I started a blog in like 2016 and and he was the, one of the people that was running the SoundCloud with him, Thousand Man Fawny, Lucky, and then there was like Warhol. Those are the ones that I remember where I was like super into it. They were on the plug channels on YouTube, like shout out Perfect Plug, uh, among others. I can't remember other names, but those they were running shit. So I just feel like he doesn't get enough credit for what he's done. Now, obviously, he's probably taking a step back. I think at one point he even said he was changing his name to the act because he just didn't want to be associated with like his old name or whatever other fans were saying in the underground because he he was like he's he's an og in a way so he doesn't get associated with like the can cans and the summers and the autumn because he's older so he wasn't part of that group necessarily but then he got wrapped up into it but then maybe he didn't like that because it was almost like it was trendy in a way whereas he's already been in the game for a while but still i'm the one who doesn't give uno his props bro i give uno his props what are you talking about I like Uno's music. I just think sometimes, like with the, I just couldn't listen to a whole Rage album when that was trendy because we liked it for a while, but it just, when everybody hopped on it, I was like, I've already heard all of these loops a million times or like something similar. And it was just manipulated in a certain way to hit like a certain, a different note. And I, I just couldn't listen to it. So that was the issue. But if he's going back to the trap shit before this gets ran through because Cardi's hopping on it and then everybody else is going to do it too. Like this, I, this is like, this is, this is what I really got into to rap for. Like these kind of beats, like the more dark shit, not the, not the rage. Although the rage was cool for a minute. And I feel like if you do it right now, like as if you do it right in this period, you can still finesse it. But it just got to a certain point where it like sounded cliche. But there are times where, yeah, Uno has some mid songs, but everybody has mid stuff. If you're dropping enough music, you're going to have mid music. And he's dropped so much. But this song, hard, hard. The trap sound ain't going to get ran, ran through. Yeah, I can see that because this is like the roots. This is the roots of like 2010s, 2000s.